Yeah, stray cats and dogs are one thing, maybe a random fox or a skunk even in your neighborhood. But an alert researcher from Texas Tech has found another animal living here in Lubbock that you're just not going to believe. KMAX Laura Lawhead's here to tell us all about it. Exactly, Brian. It's not a dinosaur per se, but a Texas Tech doctoral candidate has made a historic discovery nonetheless. A handful of beavers, of all things, are once again here in Lubbock at May Simmons Park for the first time in thousands of years. It took them a little while, but they made it back. It's a story 5,000 years in the making. Beavers are officially back on the South Plains. The man who made this discovery is Texas Tech doctoral candidate Garrett D. Langua. There's a lot of, of lakeshore here and a lot of habitat, and so who knows how many could really be here. He says these beavers have been coming in from the east, secretly working up tributaries of the Brazos River over the last decade. His research started November 2015, when, to his shock, he and some others spotted a dead beaver at Mackenzie Park a creature that they thought hadn't lived here since prehistoric times. When this carcass was discovered, people started thinking, well, possibly, possibly beaver could be here. Um, but we needed more evidence. And evidence he got. He set up night vision cameras to capture the nocturnal critters. And in the day, he also saw some telltale signs, including nesting areas, tunnels, and tree stubs they chewed with their giant teeth. But apparently, these Lubbock beavers aren't your regular rodents. These beaver are particularly cryptic in their behavior. They really like to keep a low profile. Comparatively, these beaver are kind of like ghosts. Um, I've only seen the beaver in person three times, and only uh, two of those times did I get a good look at it. One of those times was captured on night vision video here. But why are these guys back all of a sudden? Wildlife is always searching for new places uh, that it can, um, that it can live, just like, just like we do. Langua says if you do find yourself face to face with a beaver, count yourself lucky, but please leave them alone. He also says to keep your eyes peeled for them crossing the road as you're driving by the canyon lakes. It took these beavers 5,000 years to get here, so the least we can do is give them a warm West Texas welcome. Pretty amazing. Laura, thank you. New at 10, the leader.